All right, Oliver Dunn. How's it going, man? Good, man. How are you? I'm doing well. I'm doing well. Your first year so far in the pros. Um, how, what has been like your welcome to the majors, like off the field moment when you're like, I'm not grinding in the minors no more and stuff like that? I think the flights. Okay. The flights are the big thing. Just, you know, you, you're on your own plane. It's, yeah. The rules aren't the same. You can kind of, if they're not on you about being buckled all the time, you yeah. can kind of lay back and relax. That, for me, I think is probably the biggest, like, not minor league part of the big leagues okay has there been any like i don't say like rookie hazing but like i think they kind of cut back a little bit on that nowadays but like anything like that for you not hazing uh, this this group is so young too that yeah there's nothing crazy that way but you know the normal got to sing a song on the bus and that kind of fun stuff what song did you have to sing i saw i sang uh oh what did i sing i sang oh uh take me home uh the West Virginia by John Denver. Oh, okay, okay, yeah, 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 Country Roads. Yeah, yeah, Country Roads, okay. that's it. Yeah. All right, speaking of singing, if you got another karaoke song, Life on the Line, what song are you nailing all the words? That one's the one I'm going to be closest on. I don't know if any song I've got all the lyrics, but that one's the closest. Okay, are you like a big country fan, or I guess he's more, I don't know if he's a country or folksy, but like... Um, I wouldn't say I'm a huge fan okay. of the newer stuff. I guess that, like Creedence Clearwater Revival, okay, yeah, John yeah, Denver, yeah. I love that. Okay. I don't know really what to call that, yeah. but I love that kind of genre. Okay. If you can have one artist, uh, past or present, pick uh, pick out your walkout song, Like, who would you pick to write it? Wow. I'll go with CCR. Okay. Yeah. That's yeah, all? I think that would be a cool one. Yeah. I yeah. don't know. There's, the walk-up songs are a tough one, you know? Yeah. It's like, they, especially, I like tons of different kind of music, yeah, yeah. so it's tough to kind of choose one, but they're fun. I think they're a good way to show kind of the crowd mm -hmm. what you're into and give yeah. them... Like a little personality. What do you got? What do you have right now when you walk out? Turn off the lights by Chris Lake. It's like an EDC kind of, not clubby kind of yeah. song, but it's it's a it's a fun one. It's vibey. Beat. Yeah. Okay. It's got a good beat. Do you like switch it up or just keep one like for? Have you used that same one like all season so far? No, that's my third one already. I used uh, Gangster Bop by Akon and Saint Tropez by uh, Post Malone. If you go to a gas station, what are like your go-to essentials? Ooh, I'm gonna go Reese's Big Cup and okay. a Cool Blue Gatorade. Okay. Those are my two. Are you like more of a sweets kind of guy or than, like, other than like salty? I'm kind of a chocolate guy. Okay. Like, like so Reese's, like chocolate yeah. and peanut butter, Twix are really good. Anything okay. kind of that way. I'm not a huge gummy candy guy all the time. Okay. Are you uh, are you a big NBA fan at all? No. No, I, I've, I've watched a little bit of these playoffs, but okay. I, I haven't followed it very closely. All right. So I've been asking the guys this. If you could do a starting five with your teammates, who would you pick on your starting five? Wow. Okay. So I'm going... McGill and Huddy for sure. Yeah. Size down low. I think Sal would be a good point guard. That's what he said. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I think I've heard DL Hall can hoop, so I gotta throw I got yeah, I gotta throw him in there. Who'd be another? I think I'm gonna have to go. I think Bryce Terang would probably be another like a good two yeah. or a second point guard. That's awesome. All right, so before we recorded, we were talking about your that one catch you made on third base, um, dove little face paint, no big deal. Um, like, yeah. but it was it was a great play. Like, how many people reached out to you after that? Because I feel like it was like on ESPN stuff like that. Yeah, that one was my most like viral moment yeah. so far. That, that there was a lot of interactions with that one. It was pretty cool. Dude, that's awesome. All right, um, we talked. We didn't meet in the fall league, but I was there. Um, what was like your experience like that, like in, in fall league and stuff like that? I loved the fall league. It was cool. You know, I, I originally came as like a reserve yeah, or a temp. Yeah. And, you know, Marty, the manager, the team in Scottsdale was awesome and got me as many opportunities early yeah. as I could. And things just shook out that way where I was yeah. able to play every day and played well and kind of kept it rolling from what I'd done in the season. It was an awesome experience. And I like to think a big part of why I'm here yeah. now. Yeah, I was going to say that kind of puts you on the map. Yeah, I, I think so. It was kind of the first time. I started kind of seeing some articles and yeah. stuff that way. I got some attention out there, which yeah. was awesome. That's awesome. All right, let's end on this. What are three things you're grateful for? My wife. Okay. My family and the game of baseball. Okay. I lied. One more question. I forgot you were married. What was more nerve-wracking, your major league debut or proposing? You know, probably my debut. <laughs> my, <laughs> you're the first person to say that. You know, only because I think... My wife knew I was proposing. I did yeah. a bad job of hiding oh, this secret. Okay, I know. Okay, okay. I mean, so I wasn't. It was one of those things where like, she knew it was coming. I knew yeah. it was obviously super nerve wracking yeah. too, but it was also kind of celebratory. I wasn't yeah. super nervous about it. It was. It was a cool day. I was nervous, bro. I dropped my ring. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> <laughs> I was nervous too, no doubt. But I think just her knowing it was coming yeah. took a little bit of the nerves away. You're awesome. I appreciate it, bro. Thank you. Have a